welcome to Friday Night Lights, your full recap of all of our Valley's high school football games. Now, with only two games left in the season for most of our teams, this is the night coaches hope to see their teams peaking as the postseason picture takes shape. Now, one team that's enjoyed a remarkably successful season is Rancho Mirage, and a win tonight means the Rattlers clinch at least a share of a DeAnza League title. Our own Amy Zimmer was at Desert Mirage as the Rams hosted the Rattlers. That's right, Julie. The Rattlers came into this game on a three-game winning streak while the Rams were still looking for their first win of the season. With the Rattlers being undefeated and in control of the De Anza League, here's what head coach L.D. Matthews had to say on the season. I'm excited. You know, these kids are really, you know, this is kind of a, their hard work and dedication in the offseason um, is, is the reason that we have this opportunity to, to, to find some success. And so, you know, just really excited that they get to reap all the benefits of their hard work. Now, I know coming into this game, you should never underestimate a team. What's the mindset for tonight? The mindset is to go out from the start and play Rattler football. I mean, it's, it's really what it's about, you know, playing fast and physical. Um, you know, we have to really learn that we have to respect every opponent. There's nobody we're above, and we have to prove ourselves day in, day out, each night we come to play football. Now, Rattlers made a statement right from the start. On the very first play from scrimmage, they were in the end zone, and it was just touchdown after touchdown after that, to be exact. These guys took home a total of seven touchdowns. Watch Rattlers quarterback David Talley. He was just outstanding. Talley had two rushing touchdowns of his own and threw for two, both to teammate Jada Wilson. Now, the Rams did put in a good effort, and Adrian Guzman got them on the board with a touchdown, followed by a two-point conversion by Jamie Serrano. And hey, although it was a tough game for the Rams, there was still a lot to celebrate at Desert Mirage as it was senior night and the boys soccer team were awarded their rings at halftime. Listen to this. These guys were only one of two teams in the nation to have a perfect season. Rattlers take this one in thermal 52 to 8. And Julie, like you mentioned earlier, with this win, the Rattlers clinched at least part of the De Anza League title. Exciting season for them. Both teams will wrap up regular season play away next Friday. Rancho Mirage will head over to Desert Hot Springs, and Desert Mirage will travel to Coachella Valley. Julie? Looking forward to that, and congratulations to that boys' soccer team.